Well, that was fast. Welcome to Ms. Mojo, and today we're counting down our picks for the top 10 shortest celebrity engagements. Before we begin, we publish new content every day, so be sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell to get notified about our latest videos. For this list, we're looking at some celebrity couples who were engaged for a shockingly short amount of time before actually walking down the aisle. That said, we're not ranking simply based on their length of time spent as engaged to be wed. Number 10. Miranda Kerr and Orlando Bloom One of the best-looking couples in Hollywood may not have been Endgame, but that doesn't mean they didn't have an enviable relationship. Miranda Kerr and Orlando Bloom started dating in 2007, and three years later, in June of 2010, they officially confirmed their long-speculated engagement. They were married just a month later, in a secret ceremony we still know little about even years afterward. But while the two separated and divorced in 2013, they did have a child together, Flynn Christopher Blanchard Copeland Bloom, born in 2011. There's no question that, you know, for the sake of our son and everything else, we're, we, we're going to support one another and love each other as, as parents to Flynn. And Number 9. Britney Spears and Kevin Federline You could possibly call this marriage the beginning of the end of the first leg of Britney Spears' career, as prior to her meltdown came her wedding to backup dancer Kevin Federline. The two became engaged in July of 2004 after only dating for a few months, and while Federline's ex was pregnant with their second child. So, I mean, it worked out. It worked out pretty good. Mm -hmm. Nothing Perfect. really good, baby. Uh -huh. Their surprise wedding ceremony took place on September 18th, 2004, and the entire thing is documented on their reality show Britney and Kevin Chaotic, which aired the following year. Somehow, we knew this one wasn't going to work out. You know, events that unfolded over time, you know, if you want to Google them and go back and look at them, then you'll see, you know, why it turned out the way that it did. Number 8. Tom Brady and Giselle Bündchen These two major celebs may come from different realms of the entertainment industry, but this seems to be a classic case of opposites attracting. Tom Brady and Giselle Bündchen started dating in 2006 and are still together more than a decade later. According to Brady, the couple planned their wedding in just 10 days. And on February 26, 2009, they were wed in a religious ceremony in Santa Monica, California. That celebration was only for close friends and family, however, and they planned a slightly bigger event in Costa Rica in April of the same year. Number 7. Kim Kardashian and Chris Humphreys People are always talking about how short this couple's marriage was, but it turns out they had a pretty darn quick engagement as well. I, oh, I like it. want Babe. to get married this summer. Kim Kardashian and Chris Humphreys were notoriously a married couple for just 72 days, and they were engaged for just a little longer at 90 days. And for me, I didn't spend more than I think a full week with my ex. Before we got married, we never lived together. Mm -hmm. Humphreys proposed with an over-the-top diamond ring estimated to be worth $2 million. Oh my god, we're engaged. I'm shocked right now. <laughs> the Rock wasn't enough to save things, though, and these two will undoubtedly go down in marital infamy for their quickie wedding. Number 6. Mariah Carey and Nick Cannon Mariah Carey is never one to do anything small, and her whirlwind romance with Nick Cannon is no exception. They both admit to being impulsive, marrying just weeks after they started dating. Nick, 11 years younger, proposed to Mariah here in the Moroccan room. Shortly after they officially started dating in March of 2008, they were throwing a surprise wedding in the Bahamas the following month. The two got tattoos to commemorate the occasion, with his reading Mariah and hers reading Mrs. Cannon. In an interview with People, Cannon said, In our minds, it was a love at first sight thing. Since we've been together, we've been inseparable. Sadly, that didn't last, and the marriage came to a close when Cannon filed for divorce in 2014. Number 5. Megan Fox and Brian Austin Green This one may get a little confusing. Megan Fox and Brian Austin Green met in 2004 when Fox was just a teenager and Green was already in his 30s. The reality is she was 18 when I met her, and she went through an enormous just change in her life. Obviously. Two years later, they were engaged, but ended their engagement in 2009. However, the tumultuous couple reportedly got engaged again and finally made things official on June 24, 2010, just weeks after committing to one another. Fox asserted that they had been engaged all along, but she also told reporters on June 18 of that year that they had no plans for a wedding and yet married a few days later. Number 4. Cameron Diaz and Benji Madden 
This is another couple who not only had a short time between getting engaged and getting married, but who also hadn't dated long before deciding to get hitched. Cameron Diaz and Benji Madden may seem like an unlikely match, but from everything we've seen from them, they seem happy as can be. What do you call him? What do I call him? I call him a lot of names. <laughs> like, when you're happy but with him, what do you call him? But what I call ah, my buh. The two started dating in 2014 and were married in a small ceremony the following January at Diaz's LA home after being engaged for just 17 days. Sometimes when you know, you know. Number 3. Khloe Kardashian and Lamar Odom You guys, I have something to say. I'm getting married! What? In nine days. Wait, but I'm being serious. I'm engaged. To Lamar? Who else am I engaged to? If you didn't keep up with celebrity news but did keep up with the Kardashians, then you were in for a surprise. I think I've found a woman that I'm compatible with. Well, so what does this mean? That I want to hang out forever. I want to get married right now. You would marry me? I would do it right now. In the course of just one episode, Chloe announced that she was dating professional basketball player Lamar Odom, and the two quickly became engaged, getting married only days later in a lavish ceremony that took place on September 27, 2009. In addition, it turns out the two had only met a month earlier. And as TV viewers, we got to see many of their marital problems unfold on the show, and their ultimate, though not surprising, split. I will always love Lamar. I wish we could live that perfect life that we once had, but it's not that easy. He just wants to run from his problems. Number 2. Ludacris and Adoxy Bridges I'm a creative guy. You gotta be creative, you have to be different, and these things stick with women for the rest of their lives, so I had to go above and beyond it. At the end of December 2014, rapper Ludacris announced that he was engaged to his longtime girlfriend Adoxy. The lucky lady shared a photo of the epic proposal, which seemed to take place aboard a private jet. And I had written in the grass her name and will you marry me. So once she saw it and we looped around, of course she used to burst out into tears and was just extremely happy. So it was a pretty original idea there. Celebrity media was shocked to find out a few weeks later, however, that the couple had made things official on the same day the proposal took place. They shared some photos on Instagram of the event, and both cleaned up pretty darn nice for two people who possibly didn't know they'd be getting married that day. Before we unveil our top pick, here are a few honorable mentions. You had, it was smallish, right? Uh, yeah. That actually was smallish. Yeah, um, yeah, it was small and it was nice. My family and it was just great. Kids dancing and. Number 1. Tommy Lee and Pamela Anderson They didn't just have a shockingly short engagement, the former Lees had a shockingly short relationship as well. In fact, they were tying the knot just 96 hours after having their first date. And an epic first date it was. Tommy Lee and Pamela Anderson found themselves traveling to Cancun, Mexico, and married there on February 19, 1995, with Anderson sporting a bikini for the ceremony, sealing the deal by getting matching tattoos. Perhaps unsurprisingly, this hasty marriage did not last, and they divorced in 1998. Do you agree with our picks? Check out these other great clips from Ms. Mojo, and be sure to subscribe and ring the bell to be notified about our latest videos.